Yo, what is poppy YouTube? It is your boy Madness, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are straight up going into quads, and I want to talk about something very exciting for the console community. And dang, bro, it's warm ups, relax. Why are you sweating already? All right, so we are talking about console FOV, and this is something brand new that's coming out very soon. I uh, so well that was a very bad landing. So basically we are talking about console will be coming out to Warzone 2 and this is something very huge and quite possibly confirmed. Well I wanna start off by saying that for Modern for 2 2022 it is like 95% confirmed man because on Twitter there are a lot of leakers that be you know doing this for their job and they said they also show like you know, inside leakers saying that console FOV is actually coming to Modern Warfare 2 2022, and I'm so excited because, man, 2019 Modern Warfare, I was just on my PS4, and then I switched over to PS5 eventually. And as you guys probably know, if you guys are an OG of the channel, that is what my roots are. That is where I came from. I always played on console. So that's why, you know, console FOV is something that I still really want. And quite possibly, if it comes out, I'm, I'm going to switch back. I really want to play on my PS5 now and see how it is because I do love the whole console community and that is something that I do want to go back to eventually if they do, you know, bring out console for me. Since they haven't at this point, I've been just on my PC and that's what I've been doing lately. So yeah, let's quickly get this load out actually. Let's see how this... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a rocked automaton and people have been just using this lately because I don't even know what the meta is, bro. Can my teammates pop a UAV? Please, man. I, I know I got them all muted, but you know, if you can hear me... Please pop a UAV. That would be appreciated, man. You guys should know better. So, yeah, I mean, cost of FOV, man. That would be the biggest thing this game ever gets. And, you know, if it's on Modern for 2, we can assume that it'll be on Warzone 2 as well. I gotta get my aim right, low key. Gas is right on your tail. Dead! What the? Bro, 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 bro what? <laughs> Bro, SEAL Team 6 just pushed me right now. Bro, nah, you can't make this up, bro. Oh my god. Bro, that was Task Force 141, bro. As we were talking about for 2, that's exactly what just happened. Bro, I am in awe. Do I go back? Bro, they have my guns. This guy's about to kill me. Actually, he sucks. That is actually very sad. Time is up. Contract failed. Bro, can I get the friend? Thank you. Nearby, friend, no, no, get my Yes, sir. Actually, you take that. Damn, I need to make a put decision. What am I doing? Yeah, so yeah, um, guys, I mean, like, what? Let me know in the comments below how long you guys have been waiting for console with me. I know for many of us. Uh, uh, get in the hole! Boy, if you don't get. I know for many of us, it has been for years. For me especially, you know, I have been winning since I was on PS4, man. And that was, I think, I guess two, three years probably for this game's lifetime in the for 2019. And, you know, I just always wanted one. You guys are an OG of the channel, you know that that is something I just preach for my community, for the console community for years, man. I would do live streams. I would always stream every single Warzone. Oh! Hey, bro, I'm not gonna play good right now. I just wanna talk and vibe, bro. You can't even do that in this damn sweaty game. So, yeah, I would always live stream every single event, hoping to see like an update of an FOV slider or something like that. But it never happened. I waited, I'm gonna say, a total of like. Uh, damn, bro, he's flashbang me. Bro, what the. Bro, I got SEAL Team 6 coming at me. Do you guys hear how many footsteps is coming? Oh my god. Actually dookie. Actually dookie. No way you let me do that to you. No way, bro. Look, I got the SEAL Team 6 still coming at me. Oh my god, my heart's racing. Oh my god. You know what? Screw it. I got armor. I can fight a little bit. Let's see. Start third party. with me assist. Oh my god. Bro. Come out here, buddy. Come out here. Oh my 
Like, I see me as far away too. But yeah, I mean, if you guys are an OG to the channel, you guys know that I've been always, you know, just waiting for an FOV slider for console. Eh! Wow. I got lucky there, Loki. But yeah, so as soon as I saw this tweet by some, you know, credible Warzone leakers on Twitter, I just got so excited. And I'm gonna put the tweet on the screen right now. You guys will see there's a high chance. Can I kill him? Come on, just one bullet, just one bullet, just one bullet. Damn, let's go, baby. Low key, I'ma thirst him. My kills are low. And I don't know where people are, so I'ma just follow him. How did he not die yet? No way he has self, right? Wow. Actually insane. But don't worry, I'ma fight back. Don't worry, player. Oh, you're coming. Damn, bro. He was a Oh, his team is on each side, bro. What am I playing, man? Am I playing Rainbow Six Siege? Like, y'all, like, got positions and stuff like that? But yeah, you know, console FOV, I cannot wait, man. Mono for 22. What? Mono for 2 2022. It has been basically confirmed almost. And honestly, another thing is, if they do not add a console FOV, the game, I mean, it'll be a huge mistake. And we know why. The community is cutthroat. We all, you know, voice our opinions on Twitter, especially and everywhere. And we all let them know that, hey, this is not right. And we've been telling them for so many years that, you know, not having console FOV is not right. So if they do not give FOV, that will be like the last straw for them. Like, the community will just completely fall apart. And, you know, no one will want to buy the game. No one will want to play the game. So I think they should know by now that that's something that is very favored by the community. It's something that they really want. You know, us console folks. So if they do not add it, that will just completely be a bad look on their end. So, you know, I have high hopes. I'm sure a big company like Activision does not want to have, you know, their loyal fan base, you know, become unloyal, I guess you can say. You know, if Call of Duty has been just, you know, not listening to their fan base, why would the fan base want to give them their money, you know? So I'm sure... Oh my god, what just happened? Bro, what the hell? Did he just kill himself? Bro, this gameplay is so... It's filled with so many funny moments I'm not going to get so yeah, that's why I have some high hopes for it. You know, obviously I shouldn't because Call of Duty should just never have high hopes for any COD game, to be honest. Oh, come on, just peek one second. He's actually a bullet, though. Please peek. I'm doing such a dog performance. And my teammates are dead. Enemy dropping into the AO. No way. No way, bro. Good luck. No way, bro. No, bro. Alright, bro. That wasn't even him. Uh, well. So, as you guys can see on this tweet, man, we see that on June 9th, that's when it was announced. And this is shortly after the reveal of the gameplay for Modern for 2 2022. And it is saying that we can confirm that Modern for 2 has FOV on consoles. And there are very, you know, different takes on this. You know, some people say that is a confirmed 100% we're getting it. And there are some people saying 85%, maybe 90% 90, 90 of getting it. I don't know which one, which percentage we're thinking about. But I do have a high hope that they're going to bring it finally to this game. And because of how, how much hate they got for it. When there is this much, you know, talk about having something for a game. The developers of that game has to listen, right? It's only fair. So um, we're just hoping that this is true. There are even Twitter accounts named console of FOV, this and that i don't know but like people just took this whole concept of thing and just, it just made it into a community like of vouching for it like getting a concept of so if that is not enough to show activision that we want it then i don't know what is so for that reason you know i am just waiting on some kind of information some kind of confirmation from activision themselves to finally get full coverage that you know console is coming but for now you know we're gonna take this as a grain of salt and just basically get a little bit of hope from this and i do have high hopes once again i feel like i'm repeating myself with that but i just do feel like it's gotta come you know it, it's gotta like if it doesn't then god is going to shit. so like that's why you know god has to bring it and if they don't you know COD community is going to be enraged and we all know how through some COD community is so yeah that is it man I just wanted to really ramble about concept over real quick and I am just very stoked for the future I do not I'm still thinking about pre-ordering the game I don't know if I want to pre-order on my PS5 or the PC yet because you know if it does have console with me then what's the point let me just try it on my console make some content on that and that'll be 
you know great for the future i do want to pre-order on that but i don't i don't know if there's any fov anyway so that's why i still don't know if i should pre-order that's another problem so i mean we'll just see as time goes on time always heals everything so yeah once again thank you guys so so much for watching if you guys enjoyed today's video please hit that like button and subscribe if you're new hit that bell notification so you never miss an upload leave a comment on what you guys think and let me know if you guys are excited for concept fov other than that, thank you guys so, so much and take care. I love you guys. Peace.